Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve problem 6.46 from study Kubuk. So the question is find Vc, IL, and the energy stored in the capacitor and inductor in the circuit of figure 6.69 under DC condition. So we have one keyword here which is under DC conditions. Under DC conditions means that capacitor can be replaced by open circuit. And then inductor can be replaced by short circuit. That is under DC condition. So let's put that in. So not under DC condition. It's like that. So we need to redraw the circuit under DC condition. Okay, let's do exactly that. So we have 3 ampere here. 3 ampere current source. And that will parallel with 4 ohm resistor. So we'll have 4 ohm here. Okay, 4 ohm. And we still have that 2 ohm here. 2 ohm. But then this capacitor is replaced by open circuit. So we will have it like this. And we don't need this resistor here. Okay, and that will be Vc plus minus Vc. And we replace this one here by short circuit. Okay, and then we have IL here. I am. As you can see here, that PC is in the same node. So we can we can conclude that PC is equal to zero volt under DC condition. And then the energy stored in capacitor. We just can plug that formula, 1 half C Vc squared. But then Vc, Vc is 0, so we will have 0. And the unit here will be Joule. So this is the capacitor. So add capacitor. And then add the inductor here. So we need to find out IL. We can use anything, uh, maybe we can use, uh, I think I can use KVL there instead of node. So we will have IL is in this loop, but remember that we have 3 ampere at this loop. Okay, so maybe we can just use KVL. KVL and IL. L. So in this resistor here, I will have 4 multiplied by IL minus 3 plus, and then this one will be to IL, and all of that will equal to 0. Okay, and we can solve this for IL. Okay, let's do exactly that. So we'll have for IL minus 12 plus 2 multiplied by IL. That will equal to 0 or 6 IL is equal to 12 and then IL will be 2 ampere. So we have IL at inductor we have IL to ampere and then we can calculate the energy. So we will have IL is equal to 2 ampere and then the energy stored at inductor is equal to 1 half L IL squared. The inductance is 0 0.5 Henry. So I will put 1 half multiplied by 0 0.5 which is also 1 half multiplied by 2 squared, but then all of that will cancel out, 
And so we'll have EL is equal to 1, 2. So we have answered all the question, the question asked by the problem. So hopefully I did not make any mistakes in my calculation and see you in the next video. Bye bye.